Gotta love those family videos and maybe your wedding, the birth of your child, cherished moments, and you, of course, feel lucky to capture them on video so you can watch them over and over. Some local families trusted a business to transfer stuff on videotape to a DVD, but they say the company never did it. And now they're worried that those memories are gone forever on those tapes. So Action 9 investigator Jason Stojinki worked to track down the owner and get some answers. Shariva White cherishes her family video. I just read the fury. She even has this. <laughs> a whole bag of videotapes. She told me her relatives have some too. It ranges from to my grandmother attending her birthday party when she was like 12 years old, which was actually the last time of we actually had a live shot of my grandmother. So that's really sentimental for us. Um, we also had tapes of my husband proposing to me on the Thanksgiving holiday. Last year, White saw a Groupon for a company called Memories on Media to convert 10 videos to DVD, about $60. So she bought it and mailed the tapes. Went to the post office and I made sure that I had, you know, verification and tracking on that package. She told me she was supposed to have the tapes and DVDs in two or three months. It's been about 10 so far. She says the owner gave her the runaround. And then eventually the phone calls um, that I was placing would either go straight to voicemail and then the voicemail stopped picking up. I just want my tapes back. She's not alone. I found this Facebook page dedicated to upset customers of the company. There are 31 members. I also came across this. The Better Business Bureau gives Memories on Media an F rating and has this alert warning consumers about the complaints. I emailed and called the owner, but he didn't respond. So I went to his company's address in Monroe Road. Someone there told me he moved the business to Winston-Salem months ago. I found two addresses for him there, so I went. First to a business address, no one answered, then to the owner's house. He was home, wouldn't go on camera, but told me, we have not lost anything, everything is here. We are actually working with Groupon to get tapes returned to folks. We just got a little bit overwhelmed by our deal with Groupon, and everything will be returned probably within the next two to three weeks. When I asked about Shariva White specifically, he said I'll get hers pulled, and get it out to her immediately. At this point, I just want the tapes back. I don't even care about the money. You know, I can, you know, I, I don't care about the $60. My memories are worth may, way more than $60. Now I'll keep checking with Shariva White to make sure she gets her tapes. In the meantime, I'm also asking Groupon how it's handling the situation. I emailed the company last week. I'm still waiting to hear back. And Jason, as for our viewers, you always tell them if they're going to deal with any company, any business, to research that company first. Yeah, you want to do that. And in this case, which is kind of unique to these memory situations, you may even want to take out your phone and roll on the video. I know the picture quality isn't going to be great, yeah. and this isn't something that you're going to be really proud of, but you almost have to uh, wonder if you say, send these tapes off, if you never see them again, at least you'll be left with uh, some of your memories. So Get a video yeah. of a video. Yeah, that's pretty much what I'm uh, recommending. <laughs> okay, thanks, Jason. <laughs> sure. And, of course, you want to hear from anyone else who used that Groupon if they had issues? Right, exactly, because as we move forward, we want to try to help them, too, if they yeah. still need it. All right, All right. thanks, Jason. Yeah. Thank you, Jason.